Give it up to Friday Films. Enjoy the show, everybody. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Good evening, everyone. Today, we're going to look at the history of Barney the Dinosaur Macy's Thanksgiving Parade. So, this is what the balloon looks like. So, it all started in 1994 when it first debuted. And I'll show you the video now. Barney the Dinosaur. Parade of Barney Balloon continues in 1995 and 1996. So here you go, guys. Yankee Dragon, I love it. Ah, you know, even before dragons, dinosaurs roamed the earth. The only one is left alive, and we're so lucky. To be. So gentle and purple, Barney. And if he regets his keys, Barney's tall enough to reach into his sixth floor park for winter to get them. That's pretty darn tall, Willard. Barney's pretty young for a dinosaur, by the way. Only 200 million years old next month. He can't even vote yet, but of course kids don't care. They're crazy about him and his friends BJ and Baby Bob, too. They're loving every inch of purple furnished by the Lions group. And Barney's balloon captain, Michael Garucci, is delighted to hear it. Do you know where Barney lives, Willard? Of course. Barney lives in your imagination, which Barney says is a super duper place to be. Barney knows you can go anywhere and do anything in your imagination. Even dream of stupendous parades like this. Willard David Rohr is director of Pennsylvania's Carlisle High School Big Green Machine Marching Band. Woo, how's that for a title? And they're a well-oiled machine at that. Their rent-a-kid fundraiser was a hit. A nearby Harrisburg business rented 70 band kids to revamp their big... Willard, Barney is big. I'm talking big. He's not your garden variety superstar. We're talking Megasaurus. And now the so-called Elvis of the preschool set has entered the parade as a balloon provided by Lyric Studios. Barney joined us for the first time back in 1994. That would put it at his age at what? I think uh, 200 million and three? I could do a special on him. Um, Barney, just Stuart, what is the next year after 996 of the parade? 997, sir. No, God! No, God, please, no! 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 Uh, here we are, 
1997 parade. It was also promote to Barney's Great Adventure. People who wonder what's so bad about this? Well, well, bad things are happening downtown in the 1997, and there were some balloons that survived, but some of them inflated. Unfortunately, Barney was one of them on the accident. So here's what really happened. Barney was supposed to be behind the Texas band, but unfortunately it was pulled to another balloon. But alas, here comes Barney, the balloon. There are still winds happening downtown in New York City. They were just trying their best to pull in during the incident. And as you see, he's still having a lot of trouble during this time. It happens right in front of the whole fans. Isn't that crazy? That is not super deep duper. You can see the handlers are trying their best to stay Barney down. I'll show you that in a minute. And here he is. They were trying to pull up. But unfortunately, what really happened is about to be too late. So guys, if the blues is not really hair as well, they normally should the price for this. Or they did it from the back to the 96. So here we go, guys. Historic purple people pleaser, the balloon Barney. This stupendous balloon is furnished by the folks at Lyric Studios. Now, of course, unfortunately, Barney had to succumb, succumb to the winds as well. This is on tape. Balloon Barney's fourth great adventure down Broadway. So this five-time Emmy winner is an old friend by now. 200, mere, 200 million years old, to be exact. Do you guys know where Barney lives? Well, I heard after he wrapped up the film, he bought a pad in Malibu. Oh, tell him, Al. <laughs> Barney lives in your imagination. Oh, I knew that. You think <laughs> You know, all the balloons that are vertical are the ones that have had the most trouble uh, with the winds, and that's why we've had those problems. This is the 1998 balloon. Surprisingly, despite the accident last year, he was able to rebuild and was able to come back. It is pretty exciting because Barney is celebrating this 10th anniversary, guys. Of course it was. Barney will continue in Macy's Thanksgiving Parade, 1999. All set to have a super de duper millennium is Balloon Barney, also furnished by Lyric Studios. The real Barney, by the way, will be roaming the U.S. and Canada on a two-year tour of the live show Barney's Musical Castle. If Barney weren't already a star, he might experience a little age discrimination in the workplace because he's 200 million years old. Well, he looks pretty good, Katie, and much taller than any T-Rex in history. He's half the size of the Museum of Natural History, just two blocks up from the parade starting line. He's stupendous. Red Hot Recording Star. Now we're going to 2000. That's the year I was born. So this is the new millennium. So here we go, guys. Well, thank you very much, 
Barney. Now check out the stupendous one as he roams down Broadway. High five in the crowd for the sixth consecutive year. Balloon Barney really is stupendous, three times taller than any T-Rex in history. Barney is furnished by Lyric Studios and his super de duper advice for his millions of fans. Well, always be kind and be sure to say please and thank you. And be sure to visit your dentist at least twice every million years. <laughs> this dino star who lives in your imagination, like all of today's balloons, was brought to life through the imagination of the creative staff at Casey's Design Studio. Barney will still continue flying around in 2001. DJ and Baby Bob, following in his own footsteps, is our old, 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 old yeah, friend. We get it. In fact, he makes a friend like this once. Once every 200 million years, Balloon Barney is furnished by him to entertainment. And our prehistoric pal proves that wisdom does in fact come with age. Barney's been a friend and teacher to kids in more than 100 countries on six continents. How does the purple one get his kicks? Well, the real Barney danced with the Rockets in a show that was a gigantosaurus sellout. Balloon Barney had to sit that one out, however. He can barely duck his head into that 60-foot high grand foyer of Radio City Music Hall. You all know his favorite saying. It's the Super D Cooper. You're scary out there. It's Macy's Parade, number three, Bird. It was one of the balloons of Balloon in Universal Studios. That includes Barney, Cassie, Head of Woody Pecker, Rocking Bullwinker, Wild Thing, Jamie Neutron, Cat in the Hat, Snoopy, Garfield, Scooby-Doo, and Pikachu. Now we're in the 2002 parade. This time, Barney's no longer owned by Lurk, but Hit. These are himself, Balloon Barney, furnished by Hit Entertainment. Everybody's favorite T-Rex is roaming down Broadway for his ninth stupendous year. The longest running balloon in this 76th anniversary parade. You know that Barney is big on old world values like being kind and saying please and thank you. And he thinks giving hugs is dynamite. Although you'd have to climb six flights of stairs to throw your arms around Balloon Barney. Now for any dino dolls watching Balloon Barney today, some personals height, three times taller than any T-Rex in history, favorite food, peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, and favorite saying, Super D Duper. Birthplace, your imagination. The Scataway New version is now retired but i will make a part two with the barney's new balloon please check it out guys